Stand by. This is how Leandra Lepko relieves stress as a member of the International Practical Shooting Confederation. If I'm having a rough day, you know, just down in the dumps, I like to come out to the shooting range and shoot my problems away. It's all about speed and accuracy. 4977. What we do is we teach people how to use a handgun safely and use it in different situations where, you know, where you could possibly use a handgun. But she's not just learning to shoot, she's also earning high school credits. In Alberta, this qualifies as a special project where students design a course they couldn't ordinarily take in school. The fact that they design their own curriculum, uh, they have more vested interest in the, the, uh, what they're trying to learn and I think are more dedicated to what they're trying to learn. At first, Leandra's project caused some concern here. Of course, uh, the initial reaction, we're talking about firearms and uh, the environment with firearms and school is after Columbine and the, and the, and the Tabor shooting and so on. Uh, one's a little leery, but at the same time, I think uh, Leandra put together a, a pretty good program with support from her parents and, uh, and certainly a, a qualified instructor. To earn five credits, Leandra will put in 130 hours after school, learning about firearms and safety, practicing and competing. It gives uh, Leandra an opportunity to be a leader uh, and uh, to demonstrate that uh, she's a responsible young lady and, uh, and can be trusted to use firearms in a safe and uh, proper manner. It's really boosted my confidence. You know, I, I go out here and I'm competing against 10 other older men and I'm the only female underage shooter. So her stepfather and mother are both shooters. She's with us every, every Thursday night, all evening, and she's enjoying being with us, and it's, it's, it's great. It's also brought Leandra some attention from other students. They look at me funny, it's like, what? I'm kind of thinking that, and actually some people are actually scared to even come around me because I shoot. Leandra says the experience has influenced her plans for the future. Anything, any career path that I take is going to involve a gun. I know that. <laughs> and that could mean joining the police or becoming an armed security guard. Mike Vernon, CBC News, Tabor.